everyone so in this video I'm gonna show you what I eat in a day and this is going to be a typical healthy day for me so on one of my typical healthy days I eat breakfast at home I pack my lunch and I also eat dinner and dessert at home I don't buy any outside food so this isn't how I eat all the time but if I've had a particularly indulgent weekend or something like that this is how I'll kind of reset myself during the week so by the time the next weekend rolls around I'm ready to go out for a nice dinner dinner or perhaps buy a little treat or something like that. So let's go ahead and jump into the footage. I always start off the day with a caffeinated drink and some lemon water. So here I'm just having some of my Sencha green tea. I'm just steeping it for a couple of minutes. For my lemon water, I fill half of my mason jar mug with some cold water from the fridge and then I squeeze in a little wedge of lemon and then I fill up the rest of my mason jar with some hot water. I typically make my tea and my warm water with lemon first thing in the morning after I've brushed my teeth so once my tea is done steeping I'll go ahead and finish getting ready my breakfast always changes but this morning I'm having some Greek yogurt this is the 0% but sometimes I use the 2% I take quite a bit of the Greek yogurt this is probably equivalent to around one to one and a half of those single serve containers since this is plain yogurt I'm going to be flavoring it with something sweet I used to use honey but lately I've taken to using jam instead I like it because because it has that fruity sweetness but I can control the amount that I put in. This particular morning I put in around one tablespoon of the Bon Mama Wild Blueberry Preserves and I love this jam. This brand and the Saint Dalfour are probably my favorite. I generally like to put some fresh fruit on top but my bananas weren't quite ripe enough yet and I didn't have anything else. So in terms of toppings I just used hemp hearts. I used around one tablespoon and then I also used some unsweetened shredded coconut and I used one tablespoon spoon of this as well. Once I get to work, I make myself another green tea and just get a glass of warm water. And because I'm working and I no longer snack while I work, I find that's enough to sustain me until lunchtime. So let's rewind back to the morning where I prepared my lunch at home. I've been having spinach salad lately. I have this pretty much every day unless I'm going out for lunch or unless lunch is being brought into the office. So I take quite a bit of spinach. This is around two to three large handfuls. I just pack it into the container but not too tightly because I still wanna add a few things like a hard boiled egg and a tablespoon of hemp hearts and I also add half of a chicken breast. So this is a chicken breast that I baked in the toaster oven the night before and it's seasoned with some salt, some cayenne pepper, and this beet powder that I have. It's a spice mix that I got from an old seasons box I believe that is really delicious. I'm also going to have half an avocado so I just basically slice it in half, I take out the pit, and I scoop out all of the deliciousness and just place that right on top. We're back at work now and I'm going to to show you the dressings that I've been using with this salad. I basically use a tablespoon of each of these. They're both by Renee's. One is the Mediterranean Greek vinaigrette and the other is the roasted garlic Greek yogurt dressing. Mix it all up, mash up the egg and the avocado and it's ready to eat. In the afternoon I typically have another glass of warm water but on this day I decided to have the Tisano chocolate tea because I needed something chocolatey but I just had the tea by itself. I didn't add any sugar. I wanted something sweet after that so I just had a banana a clementine and a little box of raisins I'm going to an exercise class tonight so I don't have a lot of time to make dinner so I'm just going to make this tortellini I love this stuff my favorite are the cheese ones I don't really like the ones with meat in them so I'm going to be making this with some cauliflower and I'm going to be using um, an artichoke and asiago sauce it's actually a tapenade but I use half of the jar for a sauce I normally use pesto but the tapenade seems so much lighter so I decided to go with that and give it a try and I really really like it the flavor is amazing I think I'm also gonna dump a bunch of spinach in the sauce because I have a ton of spinach left so here is the sauce and then I'm just gonna ladle in the tortellini So here is the finished pasta. This took me about 10 to 15 minutes to make, so super easy and um, quite delicious as well. I basically just throw in any kind of vegetable I have, and I also put in some garlic pepper, a teensy tiny bit of salt, some oregano, and some basil. Here is my portion of tortellini. This is a pretty small bowl, but I'll probably get seconds. And I'm just gonna add a little bit of Parmesan, I think. 
I'll just do this little spoon and I like to kind of do it in layers so once I eat the top layer I might put another spoonful that was a big chunk and then I'm probably gonna add a few drops of the Frank's red hot this is the extra hot because the other one I kind of got used to but let me just add a little bit not too much okay I think that should be good. So that was really yummy. I'm having another small portion. I just came home from my aerial hoop class and it was really hard, but so much fun. I'm really, really glad I decided to take that class. And uh, my friend is actually thinking of doing the six week series. So uh, if she does it, I may join her, but I'm in a lot of pain right now. Anyway, uh, the only thing I've had since dinner was um, this water. So I'm almost done. I'm going to have the rest before I take my shower and then I'm going to have a little snack. So this is just um, 500 milliliters of water and it's not uh, flavored with anything. So my snack is gonna be this sweet potato. I baked it in the toaster oven a couple of days ago and I just heated it up in the microwave. So I'm gonna have this and finish the rest of my water from this morning. And that will probably be it for tonight. So that is basically it for what I eat in a day. And this is, again, a typical healthy day for me. And I tend to eat this way around three to five times a week, depending on what I have going on and whether I have uh, dinners booked with friends and such. But I find that if I follow this eating regimen for around three to five times a week, I'm able to keep my weight um, pretty static. And I I don't really have an issue with um, indulging on the weekend. That is it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching and until I see you next time please take care and bye for now.